At our house, we use reusable tumblers instead of glasses. And my daughter just asked me to fill it up hers. Totally easy. Click that. I walk away if I need to. It tells you how many ounces. So it leaves about that much at the top. Before I go, I'm gonna show you the, has cubed and crushed, and the cubes are not very big. Compared to my last one, it just doesn't come out as fast or as much, but let's just fill this in. Okay, so that's how it looks with the ice shapes. And I also dropped one on the floor. Is this the easiest fridge to clean? I honestly liked my last one and we remodeled our kitchen and my husband wanted to get all GE Cafe appliances. And so we upgraded our refrigerator and I have to tell you, I'm so glad that we did. If you're new, make sure to subscribe. We'd love to see you then. My goal with everything we chose was to make it easier to clean and keep clean. And I would much rather have things be low maintenance than the style, but I hope to have both. However, with the GE line, I felt like we did get style because this is so modern and sleek looking. I want you to know that this video is not sponsored. If you're GE Cafe, we would love it if you had sponsored us or if you would in a future video, but we purchased all this for remodeling Model. The thing is, when you invest in your kitchen, where we spend a lot of our time, it pays off. I like cooking more, I like being here, and our family seems to spend the most time in the kitchen. And if you want to check out this exact GE Cafe refrigerator, I'll put a link in the video description because they're all a little bit different. Like I mentioned before this, we had a stainless steel fridge and it was always a pain to keep clean. There were fingerprints on it. The handles were always dirty. I was always going over it with a wipe. If you weren't careful, it showed streaks. So even though I like the look of this model better, and I've seen lots of YouTube videos with it, it didn't come in platinum glass. So this is platinum glass. And what it is, it's stainless steel, just like all the other appliances we had. However, it has a glass layer on top of it. And so that is key. It does match stainless steel appliances because it has that same look. So our dishwasher, our oven, and our microwave do not have the platinum glass. They're just stainless. And I spend far more time cleaning those than the refrigerator. Another thing I like about it is it doesn't require any specific stainless steel cleaner. You can use a wipe or Windex. I like to use a microfiber cloth. I love Mr. Sega. We've talked about them for years. They're on Amazon. I'll put a link in the video description, but they're soft, they're really inexpensive, and they work great. So you can just clean it with a damp microfiber cloth. The only parts that really get that dirty are these parts where you touch it. But again, it just doesn't look dirty very easily. It just stays so nice. And then you can just turn this over and use the dry side and go ahead and dry it. And you know what? I did not clean this before the video. It actually just stays looking so great with very minimal effort. Yes. Our last refrigerator had the handles that stuck out and this one has it flat. So you just go like this to open them. And I, it took me a little while to get used to that because I'm used to pulling the handle. And I like that this is so flush and streamlined. Here's another feature of this refrigerator that sold me is the four compartments. Even before we got this fridge, we actually kind of segregated the refrigerator because my husband is such a neat freak. He likes his stuff to breathe and have lots of extra space. Well, I tend to cram my fridge pretty full, but this fridge is divided up. So right now it's way full because we're into those meal kits and we have a lot, we just got a delivery, but you can guess which side's mine and which side's his. Usually it's way more obvious than this, but this is my side right here in my door. <laughs> and here is his side. We are into freshly like crazy right now. So it's full freshly and my stuff has migrated to his side, which he hates. And then we even have the, the freezer divided. This is his freezer and this is my freezer. This is the most easy to find, best organized freezer I have had in my entire life. And I was really afraid that it wouldn't fit very much stuff, but we used to have a pull out drawer and things would get lost in it, especially things on the sides and the bottoms. And you know, it's hard to keep organized, but so you can actually make this into fridge, 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 and freezer. So this can be set with these controls to be whatever temperature you want. 
and it has a wine rack that you can see right here that pulls out and people put their drinks on this side but we need the freezer space so the wine rack has some shrimp that's a door alarm oh i just discovered something we didn't take off the plastic so it does have these really roomy drawers so there's that and this one's a bigger drawer but i can pretty much see everything in it my side i don't have anything in this drawer but it just pulled out like that but these are so great i can see everything like my favorite pizzas these are from costco and i love them we eat them all the time and dino nuggies which is every kid's favorite my mommy made dino nuggies and there's this miscellaneous things but these have been so much better than i ever dreamed they're so easy to keep clean and organized i don't have to buy any containers and i can see easily now that's another thing about the fridge i didn't talk about is it has a backlight so this is an led light that lights up from the behind then it has a light up here and it has lights that you can see on the sides. And so what it does is it illuminates everything and compared to any other fridge I've had before, I can just open this up and easily see what I have. In the past, like some things hide inside the fridge and you don't find them until they start to rot and you waste a lot of food. So I love that feature so much. It just, and also it just kind of looks cool. There is one feature in the fridge that I cannot figure out for the life of me. And I want to show it to you in case you have the same thing in your fridge. This is common in a lot of refrigerators. It's this shelf. Look how it just goes back behind that one. And why would you ever want to do that? Well, if you're the kind of person that wants to stack things higher like that, or you have some milk that wouldn't fit, that's what that is for. So I just want to know, am I the only one that didn't know that? Because I was so curious what that was for. They have different things called counter depth. And that was when the refrigerator is the same depth as the counter. So it's flush right here, but ours, it didn't fit and we needed a bigger fridge. So it's not flush with our cupboards and counters, but I do, and at first I felt like it was a little bit crowded, but now I'm totally used to it and I don't notice at all. I've took out some of the top shelves just to show you how pretty that is. All the shelves are adjustable. You can see that you can make them higher or lower. It's summer, my kid's home from school, so we are really stocked up this right now. The one thing I didn't like is if you decide to use this as a freezer like we did, there is not a replacement or another part for where the wine rack is. You are you know, you're stuck with this. So I wish that they had an option to have a drawer here instead. The GE Cafe line is a pricier appliance, line of appliances for sure. It's more than our GE profile, but it's not as much as a custom refrigerator would be. And it's not as much as a custom build. This is Energy Star rated, so it doesn't use as much energy. I know a lot of people talk about appliances in the past and how great they were and how much better they clean or do a job, but I actually like more modern appliances. I know they may not last as long, but they're way more sophisticated. I don't have cold spots that are freezing my produce or anything like that. But the big thing is the energy use is so much lower with the Energy Star rated refrigerator and appliance. They're just so much more efficient. Overall, it met my goal of being easy to clean and that's the thing I really wanted. I don't know why when I heard glass, I thought, what if you accidentally shut this really hard? Is it gonna break the glass or is it fragile? But no, it's, I can't even tell it's glass. And to me, it's easier to keep clean than a white appliance a black appliance, and of course, a stainless steel. I would buy this again. I love it. Thanks for subscribing, liking, and sharing this video. If you wanna check it out, I have a video about what I wanted to accomplish with my remodel. I'll put a link to that above, and we'll see you in the next video.